Hey guys, um, I don't know how long this vlog will be, or uh, when I'll get back. I'm going to uh, hand in a job application for a second job. Um, but I think, I believe the masks are coming today. Um, with the masks I ordered right before the Halloween Asylum sale ended. And actually, I'm glad I ordered them because both of them are now out of stock. So I'm pretty glad I ordered those because I've watched them all year. Um, but then I'm pretty much done for masks for the year because I don't want every actor wearing a mask. And I have about three or four zombie masks, skull mask, uh, a butcher shop half mask. So, you know, I have a good quantity of masks and I want some actors to be wearing makeup effects and appliances and stuff like that and so we'll go with that. Um, we'll still have to figure out costumes and stuff but that's so long away, don't worry about that. Um, yeah, so we'll do an unboxing video for that. I ordered the mechanics, the, not the mechanics, the inner workings for the spitting rat. Just the, not the spitting part, I can always add that in later. Um, I'll probably finish the skeleton this weekend, um, because I have off tomorrow, but I work in the morning, so we'll see. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to go do that, and we'll, uh, we'll see what happens when I get back. Maybe the mail will be here. Hey guys, so I was kind of in a bad mood after, uh, I went, when I went down there, after the guy told me to go down there, and, uh, told me that there's no opening so in, in a snotty way. I held my patience. I, I was going to scream at him. I was going to, because, especially because it's now hiring, it's not on the door. I don't know whether it is. So I was kind of pissed. And then I come home and I have mail. But more importantly, I have a citation from Dave Denenberg, who is the Nassau County Legislator. And it's like a certificate. It says, whereas a county is only great as those who individuals who display exemplary effort within their community, and where such service often goes unrecognized. Now, in recognition of your creativity, hard work, design, and architecture of a magnificent Halloween display, David W. Denenberg, Nassau County Legislator for the 19th Legislative District, on behalf of the Nassau County Legislator and the people of the 19th Legislative District, do hereby recognize, acknowledge, commend the artistry of Chris Tarpey on the first day of November 2011. And he signed at the bottom, and actually, it's like a background image, but the, uh, you can see the eyes. Let's see if I can show you. Those are like eyes, and it says Halloween, and like the back, it's like, a, it's like in the back of it. That's awesome. I know uh, my neighbor emailed him, and he wanted to drop it by. He wanted to drop it off um, to me personally, but I guess I uh, wasn't home. And I also got my mask. So it kind of put me in a better mood. Just small things like that. Just, you know, raiding up a little thing for me. I'm going to display it in my room. Um, I, yeah, I did. I was kind of disappointed when it didn't come that day. I didn't know what happened because he told my neighbor that he would stop by. So I kind of forgot about it. And then uh, he did. So let me just open this up and I'll show you the mask. Alright, um, so this is from Halloween to Fountain. I recommend you go there for your after Halloween shopping. Not go there, go to the site. Um, they have like severed heads for like nine bucks. I ordered a bunch of stuff. Um, until people order it for me, you know, Christmas stuff like that, whatever they were asking. Because the site's, you know, losing it and actually lost these two masks right after I ordered it. They're not there anymore, so I'm glad I got them. Because one of them is, it's like one of those masks that, you know, sell for like $59. I was like really happy that uh, I got it for, like 20. Really good price. Cool. Trick or Treat Studios, that's what it is. Uh, so we got this mask. Nice detail with the veins and stuff. Hmm. We got the zombie guthrig. Whatever that means. Probably 
won't get any more masks after this. This is a decent amount of masks. But I liked the detail in this one also. I really liked, you know, that mouth. And you know, like the jaw is just like completely dropped. Really good detail. And of course I'll add my own spice to it as I always do. You know, more blood detail. I do that with a lot of my masks, but I like this one. It's got the gash in the head. A bunch of different stuff. Looks like a worm. Hmm. Cool. So I'll try it out. I'll try each on and just show you what they look like. Hopefully they fit pretty good around the head. Alright, this is the first mask. It's a little bit bigger, but it's cool. The neck will be tucked in. It's got a lot of room in it, more room than the other one. So we'll put it a little bit bigger, or we'll stuff it up, or we'll even use it for a prop if we have an extra mask. So I usually use my big masks for props. But this, this is creepy. This is good for like a lurker who's just lurking around like this. No great detail. These are nice and sturdy. I'll tuck it. I'll tuck this in, you know. Maybe even get a little bit of a fatter suit. Stuff up a little bit. It's got a lot of boom. Pretty cool. I'll put on the second one, which is a little bit tighter. So I'll show you a little bit more. Here's the second one, much tighter to the face. Um, you know, it's got a nice chest to it. You know, it goes even as you know far. It's getting a little bit of the detail in there. Really nice though. Night, really tight about the face. I like that though. I like all this down here. It even gives you some space over here for breathing. But I, I like the tight masks. Better they form better to your face. I'll be wearing it a better shirt than this, but it's a really cool mask. It's good for a guy that that's looking dead, just sitting like this. Just <laughs> pretty, cool. pretty cool. So not much more on masks needed this year. Um not much I need. You know I got masks for everyone. All my actors, they can choose amongst themselves. You know, maybe someone likes the big mask. If not, I can use my masks for props. But the certificate's really cool. I'm going to hang that up. So that's uh, pretty much it. I'm not really doing much else today. It's, you know, already 4 o'clock. I'm tired already. Um, still got to upload yesterday's vlog. I've been doing different work, you know, about modifying the walkthrough and the facade, uh, getting things in the planning stage, and what else I need as far as that. Pretty cool, though. Anyways, see you guys later.